now looking back at everything that's happened, and I'm sure the, the question everybody wants to know, what do you think about Enrico Tario getting 22 years, in your opinion, uh, for not even being there on January 6th? Well, I honestly think that is a gross sentence. It's just absolutely appalling that he would get 22 years. Like you said, he wasn't even there. Um, I wonder if it has anything to do with the bias in the justice system. Um, I think if he went to trial, then that was a bad idea doing that in D.C. And then did, when you went to trial, though, Jake, did you have to go to a D.C. court or where was, your, where was all your stuff handled? Well, I didn't go to trial. Yeah, I know. You took the, That's smart. You got to take a deal. That, but these people don't realize one of my friends got 19 months and now his name's Luke Coffey. And now he's looking at a lot more time potentially. I think you have to make a deal, even though it's a deal with the devil. I, they're never going to give you a fair shot. Well, I definitely never made a deal with the devil. Um, Metaphorically, you know what I mean. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. I'm just, I'm just playing with it. But I do think that you have to read the terrain. Sun Tzu, Art of War, never fight a battle that you cannot win. You know, you don't fight in a battle where it is uphill, it's at night, and it's raining. And that's kind of what it is that we have uh, in the whole DC uh, courts is that, you know, these people are choosing to go to trial with juries that are filled with people that hate Trump and believe that January 6th was a violent insurrection. 